to the Kids Discovery Podcast. My name's Bevan. And I'm Ben. Remember last episode on dirt bikes? I do. That was a great episode. Dirt bikes are on a planet named Earth. Which is a great segue to our next topic, which is... Planets. In our solar system. We're going to go through all the planets and tell you cool facts about them. Let's start with Mercury. Quiz time. Uh, yeah. Is Mercury the closest to the sun or the furthest from our sun? That's easy. The closest. You're right. Good job, buddy. It's the smallest planet and a little tiny bit bigger than the moon. And uh, one year on Mercury is only 88 days on Earth. 88 Earth days. I learned that from the space book, Little Kid's First Big Book of Space. That's a really good book. I think we should let our listeners know about that book and recommend it to them. Mercury is the fastest planet in the solar system. And if you thought dirt bikes and monster trucks were fast, look out. Because Mercury goes 47 kilometers per second. That's way, that's fast. That's one. That went 47 kilometers in that one second. This is hard to explain, but I'll explain it. Mercury, the closest planet to the sun itself, has ice. It has ice on it? Yeah. Whoa. That's surprising, being it's the closest planet to the sun. And do you think that Mercury, because it's the closest planet to the sun, is the hottest planet? No, it's the second hottest planet. What's the hottest planet? Venus! Venus is a crazy planet because a day on Venus is longer than a year on Earth. Venus is one of the only planets also that spins clockwise on its axis. Almost everything else spins counterclockwise but venus spins the other way like the way the hands go around a clock unless you have a spacesuit on you wouldn't be able to go to venus's surface yeah because it has 90 times the atmospheric pressure that earth does earth is the third planet in our solar system and it's the only one that has life on it yeah organic life organic life of course there's a lot of animals on Earth. Probably even hundreds of thousands of animals. Fact check. There is 8.7 million species of animals on Earth. We'll save the rest of Earth for a later podcast. Yeah, there's too much to talk about with Earth. The fourth planet is Mars. Did you know Mars has volcanoes? If you remember from our volcano episode, it has the biggest volcano in our solar system. Yeah, it has the biggest volcanoes. Yes, that's cool. And a year on Mars lasts how long? Two. Two Earth years. A lot of amazing discovery is that there's water on Mars. Which is why they're thinking about maybe they could make it so that we could live on Mars someday. Yeah. Would you want to live on Mars? Yeah! What would you do on Mars, do you think? I would watch a volcano erupt. (laughs) Whoa, that would be kind of crazy. Do you think maybe you would fix robots on Mars? Yeah. Nice. The fifth planet in our solar system is Jupiter. And did you know that all the planets in the solar system could fit in Jupiter? Whoa, whoa, whoa. So you're saying if we took all the other planets in our solar system, it could fit inside of Jupiter? Yes. (laughs) Cool. That's cool. I didn't know that. Jupiter has a very strong storm. Fun with strong wind. The storm on Jupiter is called the Great Red Spot. Yeah. What's it like? 
the Great Red Spot is 16,000 kilometers wide and is big enough to engulf the Earth. The wind is going 400 kilometers an hour. That's fast. Whoa, that would be a crazy storm. Oh, yeah. That storm has been raging for 161 years. The sixth planet from the sun is Saturn. Yep. What does Saturn have? It has rings. There's eight rings on Saturn. Five dusty rings and three main rings. Saturn's rings are made of ice. They're incredibly thin at about 30 feet wide. That's very, like, that's not very big for something in outer space. There's a lot of electrical storms <laughs> on Saturn. They have sometimes have lightning storms the size of the United States. Uranus is the seventh planet from the sun. And quiz time. Does Uranus have rings? Yes. Yes, you're right. Uranus has rings. Uranus has 13 rings. And Uranus is tipped so far, it's almost on its side as it goes around the sun. It's almost spinning, doing a barrel roll. Quiz time. Oh boy. Uh oh. What is the coldest planet? The coldest planet is probably the one furthest away. What's the name? Neptune. It's Uranus. It's light blue covered with ice. Okay, that's cool. And snow. Uranus is the coldest planet. At negative 224 degrees Celsius. Yeah. That would be so cold. I don't think that you'd be outside. We can barely handle negative 30. Uranus is one of two ice giants. Which means that more than 80% of its mass is made up of ice. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> What's the other... Ice giant. Neptune. Neptune, which is the eighth planet from our sun. Did you know that Neptune has 14 moons? 14 moons? That's a lot of moons. Yeah. Neptune is a crazy place. It would be wild to be there. They have storms there all the time. They have winds that can go up to 600 meters per second. That's crazy. That is crazy. To get to Neptune, it would take... 12 years. Yeah. 12 years in a spaceship? You've, on, you've only been alive for f almost, well, five, almost six years. You'd only be halfway there. Thanks for listening to this week's episode of the Kids Discovery Podcast. We hope that you enjoyed our podcast on planets in our solar system. Please send us an email at... Kids Discovery Podcast at gmail.com. We love to read them. Bye bye. Bye bye, everybody. Bye.